E5. <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's a long story that I'll try and cut really short. So 2015, we, as a consumer, uh, as a customer to the electrical industry, and employing a lot of electricians to carry our work for me, I increasingly started to get more and more frustrated with, with challenging the same things. And because of that, I sent an email to the IET, the Institute of Engineering and Technology, and said, look, is there not something we can do to try and not educate the market, because that sounds a little bit too kind of forceful, but is there not something we can do to look at some of the issues that are affecting public safety? And they agreed, and we come together with some of these really, really industry influential organizations. And I did a presentation in Leeds in 2015 to about 50 compliance managers, and one of those managers was a, a chap called Paul Meenan. And um, Paul Meenan works in the real industry. And at the end of the presentation, he came up to me and we had a total heart to heart and we were just totally singing from the same hymn sheet. And I noticed he had a badge on his, uh, on his blazer. And I asked him, what, what is E5? What, what, is, what is this E5? And he says, it's something we have within this, this, this sector that I work in. It, it's condensed into real and, and the people who are good in real and the people who and people who deserve and they run with the ethical principles of the Engineering Council, UK spec, and they've got an E5 badge. And it was just a case of I said, why don't we span that out across the whole electrical industry? Why wouldn't we step it into every other sector or every corner of the industry? And if somebody wears that badge, they put it on their website, they post it on social media, all that's seen about that individual is, I'm ethical. I conduct myself in business in exactly the same way that the Engineering Council would ask me to conduct myself. So yeah, that's, that's E5. Um, I <laughs> focus in quite a lot on TCW, trying to, to move forward. We've got, a, we've got a lot of really exciting uh, publication uh, functionality coming in shortly and, and we're, we're expanding our team quite considerably. And, so I still try and keep involved with E5. Uh, we, we send out badges, we speak to people. I dedicate quite a lot of my time to people. Uh, there was a, a Liverpool just over the river from where we are now. Uh, there's a, an apprentice over there. I'll keep, him, I'll keep his name confidential, but he knows who he is, who, who needed advice, he needed equipment and stuff. So I personally try and help out people under the E5 badge and I, I dedicate my time. It doesn't cost anything. Um, and then, then the next steps is obviously we we have some really exciting announcements with E5 this year, and um, some affiliations, some some um, yeah. I'm not going into the details, but we, yeah, some really exciting stuff coming with E5.